how this goes. We'll see how the rest of the day uh, ends up going. So, how are you guys all? Happy Saturday. And Metal Gear Solid soundtrack's really good music, for sure. Uh, Amanda J, thank you for the 27 months. Owl Bears, thank you for the 69 months. Thank you very much. Let's work. Uh, thank you, Owl Bears. Oh, there it is. Okay. Nice. Thank you, Owl Bears. Splatoon 3, can't watch due to spoilers. Yeah, Splatoon is the uh, we did we did Night Marbles and uh, I got Splatoon nice. three. So uh, yeah, not uh, not too thrilled about that one, but uh, we'll get to that at some point. All right, another crab's treasure. Let's do it. Last thing that happened was uh, we got teleported to the uh, we found the treasure, and that sent us to the bottom of the ocean, uh, which we're now here. And, uh, yeah, I guess we're just, uh, continuing exploring. Uh, the treasure was also, like, a bunch of hundred dollar bills, which the crabs are, like, they say it's useless here. So, like, not, not good, I guess. Not for them. Uh, but, yeah. Been a lot of fun. Yeah, I also have a Nintendo 64 cartridge as my shell. I love it. I actually, uh, it's really good. I also, uh, insured it. So, if I lose it, I guess I get it back. But I'm not, I'm not sure what that really means. I've never, I never did that before, so... Uh, okay. All right. Let's say I wanted to help you find this definitely not made up lost treasure. The perfect whorl. Yeah. Where do we start? Uh, go in this ruined architecture. Follow where it leads. I'm sure we'll discover what we're looking for. Okay. Uh, what's over here? Or go that way. What's over here, though? So this is another, uh, won't open from this side. Okay. Gotcha. There's got to be like a clip through the wall kind of deal there, right? All righty. Uh, any plans to play the last viewer DLC? I have no plans on playing uh, the last spell. What's up, Jelonium? How are you? Sometimes the camera gets a mind of its own. Congrats on four whole years of putting up with me. Standing Yon, thank you for the tier 3 48 months. Thank you very much. Really appreciate that. Thank you, dude. Uh, I don't know why this it just has the fizzle ability. I'm not really sure why. Get over here! Oh, that killed them? Oh, okay. Alrighty. What the fuck is there a drain down here? How does that make any sense? You play it off stream. It's a gig. It's a great game. I I don't know what time with two with two infant girls. I don't know what time you think I have for uh, for off stream gaming. But uh, you know, I wouldn't be against it. I haven't touched my. Ooh. Oh, nice. I haven't touched my uh, Steam Deck in quite some time, actually. It's been a while. This game versus Lies of P, you can't go wrong. Well, I feel like they're both uh, kind of interesting, you know, new entries in the genre. It's cool to see the genre taking, you know, people doing their own thing with it. Uh, Absurd Joe, thank you for the 100 bits. Thank you very much. Appreciate that. Yeah, no Steam Deck for a while, actually. It's been, been quite some time. This is absolutely a trap. Yeah. You know it's a trap, but you still can't get away from it. Is this also a trap? No. Come on. Don't bullshit me. Ready? Uh, grumpy old soul. Thank you for the sub. Appreciate it. I think I only need one more stainless relic to upgrade my weapon. I think that's all I need. I wish I could find that last one. I think there's stuff in the world I've like missed. Uh, I could go back and explore other parts of the world, especially now that I have like the electricity and stuff. Uh, thank you, grumpy old soul. Yeah, yeah, I have a Nintendo 64 cartridge. Apparently, also, Going Under is this is this studio's, like, first game. So, it's like a self-reference, I guess. I like it because it has a shitload of HP and, uh... Shotgun shells. It's got a shitload of HP and it's still a medium roll, so... 
Works for me. Yeah, these are going under. Yeah, what was going under? What was that? Abyssal Plains. Whoa! What the fuck? Is that like a giant snow crab? Fuck that. Fuck that shit. The hell out of here with that bullshit. Uh, Harmontown, thank you for the 61 months. Thank you very much. I greatly appreciate that. Welcome back. Go grab this, please. What we got? I think we were, there was something back over this way. Salp. Uh, minus 50% umami regeneration plus 12 MSG. Uh, confusing reproductive behavior. Uh, okay. Sure. Looks like you, maybe you do more damage if you use it, though. Interesting. Uh, I don't know if I could kill that gigantic snow crab. I don't know if I can kill that thing. Fuck. Alright. See what does the uh, what does the map say? The map in this game is not particularly useful because you can't move it. It's weird. Like you can't look around at it. Uh, how do you crabs dodge undersea lasers IRL? I don't know. It's probably tough. <laughs> the Sekiro map. What's up, uh, Gruntiatus? How are you? Yeah, I wish you could move the map and zoom it around and stuff, but maybe that maybe that would be like too easy or something. I don't know. Yeah, lots of these. So it's a crab with a telephone on its head. Uh, do we think I can fight this thing? The fuck? like only the hammer is uh like fizzle was doing anything to this guy all right fuck that thing Eesh. oh is there are there more of them over there fuck man there's more of these guys jeez uh wrap its legs like an at, -AT? yeah maybe dude break its delicious legs <laughs> i've never had uh Never really eat crab. Beyond like sushi, I've never really eaten much crab. Okay. Crab was a divine. You have to like suck out, you have to like suck it out of the leg, right? The meat or whatever, right? Their plug fuse. Or crack it. Is that a Nintendo 64 cartridge? It is. Yes, it is. I love it. Probably, it's probably my favorite one in the game so far. <laughs> the mouse is pretty good. I like the mouse also. That looks like this could be a trap. Let's see. Let's 
Jesus Christ! I didn't even see the attack was coming. I didn't even see the attack was coming. Have you found a 1911 shell yet? Uh, no, no, dude. I, you know, I, I haven't, I haven't had a 1911 in so long. I used to pound those suckers down, dude. I haven't had one of those in a long time. Let's back that way. Uh, I guess we'll just uh, continue this way. Okay. Uh, uh, 1911 is a brand of cider. I used to, uh, man, I used to drink those on stream all the time. Haven't had one in a while. That's a, that's a long ass journey we have to get back there, ain't it? Dude, dude, this game, fuck you game. It's really good, yeah. 1911s are awesome. Yeah, there was a symbol. I, I don't know. I, I don't. It's hard to see against that guy exactly where the attack is coming from. Okay. Uh, this is definitely, uh, definitely gonna kill me right here. What was that? Did we go this way? I don't think we went this way. Yeah, the next Marbles game is Splatoon Three. Why? I don't know why, <laughs> but that is the next Marbles game. Okay, I think this is where we went before. It's five o'clock somewhere. Uh, you know, I, I don't think we have any. I don't know if we can get any easily. Squid souls. <laughs> You'll enjoy it. I wonder if there was a... So it looks like the big crabs respawn, the laser crabs. So... Probably not worth it to fight these guys. Now that certainly looks like a shortcut to me over there on that side. Uh, I'm not fighting these guys. Fuck you. Move it. Fuck these guys. Uh, I love Barb's singing voice, except when he sings voodoo. Do I have a good... You know, people say... I've heard a couple people say I have a good singing voice. I feel like those people might be deaf, though. <laughs> maybe they maybe they have a hearing problem of some kind. All right. Bail out. Yeah, I don't know if I buy it. Fuck you, crabs. Tackle pouch. Crabs want it. Fish for it. Increase the number of barbed hooks can be held at one time. Oh, okay, that's kind of a nice little upgrade. The the barbed hooks are actually a decent tool in the game, so I'm not gonna be mad about that. Okay, bonfire. You went deaf after hearing me sing. Oh, I'm sorry. That sounds really tough for you. Hmm? Night marbles was a mistake. Yeah, yeah, it was. <laughs> yeah, it was. Uh, let's grab an attack, I think. Give me some attack here. Hmm? I'm deaf and I love Barb's singing voice. Uh, hang on one sec. Let me fix the blurriness, apparently. Can we hear you sing? Uh, I don't know. I'm just gonna say I don't know how to sing. I sing a lot, but I, I acknowledge I don't know how to sing. I'm not a good singer. Let's just leave it at that. All right. I'm not gonna sing for you. <laughs> uh, hang on. Let's fix that here.
I think that thing was like hypnotizing me. I'm 100% certain you are going to fall in love with Splatoon 3. The tactics and depth of the gamma play are unlike any other. The strategy is like purchase. You are going to become a Splatoon streamer for sure. Hildebrah, thank you for the 21 months. Thank you, Hildebrah. Really appreciate that. Hey, we raised my max health. Let's go. Dude, this is ridiculous. Leave me alone. Oh my god. Wikes watching your RDR2 YouTube vids. They're great. God damn it. many fucking crabs in the ocean. Jeez. There's way too many fucking enemies here. Jesus Christ, man. Leave me alone. Really? Oh my god, leave me alone. Holy shit. Christ. All right, let's go. Get the fuck out. Don't bother. Hang on one sec. Man, oh fucking man. Balivor, thank you for the 58 months. Thank you, Balivor. Man, Red Dead Redemption 2 was so long ago. I've played that game in uh, many years now. Uh, Red Dead 2 is really good. Really, really good game. Okay, what do we got around here? It is so hard to avoid getting hit by these things. Really tough to avoid these. Okay. It's a fun game. Uh, the cartridge is in rough shape. Yeah, yeah, it is. I hope so. I guess we'll find out if I die, if I get it right back again. I guess we'll see. It's like, uh... Yeesh. Looks like a styrofoam church here. Okay. The end game is proper souls too. Yeah, I know it broke, but uh, so what I did was I bought insurance for this thing. So um, theoretically, if it uh, if it breaks, I guess I'll get it back when I respawn. But I'm not sure if that's how it works, though. Bro, I do. These things are impossible to fight. I don't want to fight these things. I may have to fight these things though, if I want to see what's over here. I feel like there might be something on top here. Uh, 
Oh, oh shit. I think I see like a shortcut. Hang on. Run! Okay, heal, please. Okay, so over there, can I make this jump? I see there's like a... Oh, hang on. Well, there would be one, but I guess I can't use it for now. Oh my god, dude, what the fuck? Leave me alone. This is like insane. These fucking, these giant crab, uh, wow, I'm just dead. These things are insane. There's so many of them. Oh my god. Holy fuck. All right, well, it looks like we found some kind of shortcut there, but uh, as to what to do with it, I don't know. I don't know, man. Yeah, yeah. These, uh, I don't know. Will these be Dungeness crabs? I feel like they look like Japanese snow crabs, but I, I don't know. Uh, I don't know crabs particularly well, I guess. I don't know my crabs too well. No, I haven't unlocked the whole skill tree yet. Also, I did get my Nintendo 64 cartridge bat, so that's nice. Hypnotized? Oh, fucking sh dude, what is this game? <laughs> Leave me alone. Good lord, man. Fucking A. Well, you can't fight them either. You can't fight them. Like, they're awful to fight. And you're going to get shot by another one while you're fighting the other one, too. You can't fight them. Oh, my. Oh. <laughs> Man, this area has gotten pretty fucking annoying, dude. <laughs> this area is... What the fuck? Stop! Christ! Why do they get laser beams? This is ridiculous! Oh my god! What is this game right now? Wow, fuck that. Holy shit. Uh, oh, party popper. The party time ability is good. I like that ability a lot. Wow, fuck that. Holy shit, fuck that. That was bullshit. All right, so this is, uh, okay, this is back where we were before. That was awful. My God. Oh, that's a skill issue on your part. Yeah, I know. It's like Dark Souls. I know. It's like, yeah, we were inspired by Dark Souls 3 angels. It's like, why were Come you on, inspired by those? <laughs> Do not be inspired by those. Those are awful. <laughs> uh, D Rockman, thank you for the 47 months. Almost thank four years. Holy much. shit. Okay, so still don't know where we're going. Ah, uh, so this is the church area. It looks like a church anyway. Uh, D Rockman, thank Thank you very much.
Let me kill this guy first. Eesh. Oh, man. They're so tanky. They're Japanese spider crabs. They're so tanky, dude. Oh my god, they get you get 5k for killing one of these guys, dude. Fuck these guys. Fuck these guys. Hate these guys. Uh they, they don't respawn. No, I think they do. Yeah, I think they do. I thought they wouldn't respawn either, and then they sure as fuck respawn. <laughs> Wishing many more years of success. Thanks for all the good times, Barb and Chat. Uh, is something else trying to hypnotize me here? Just Gamesville, thank you for 57 months. Thank you very much. Appreciate it, man. Yeah, I'm not really sure what I'm supposed to be doing here. Kind of felt like the game. Oh, entrance. Fuck you. Oh my god, Happy fuck that enemy. Bro, every enemy in the game has turned into a fuck you situation here. Fuck that dude. Anglerfish. Rob, anybody, thank you for the 62 months. Thank you very much. I was here. Anglerfish that slaps the shit out of you. All right, they did come from a rave. Ow. Fuck you. All right, now I was here, and I saw the shortcut across, uh, and I couldn't get there. So not sure what to do. Um, looks like there's an area over there. See that? Now, how do I... Can I just... Can I just jump? Oh, my God. I can just make the jump. I thought I couldn't make that jump. I I came all the way... I'm such a jackass, dude. That's all I had to do. Oh, I'm an idiot. Try again. I didn't know if I can make that jump. Apparently, I can. Man, I love the part... The party time ability is just good. It's strong, man. What's the party cracker for? So it's the shell and uh, your special ability that you have is tied to whatever your shell is. So because I have it, I can do this like shotgun blast attack. Like every shell has like a different ability. Everything's different. It has nothing to do with trusting my abilities. It has to do with not knowing my jump range. That's <laughs> two, two different things, brother. I don't think I can make that jump. Hmm. Where are we now? Lots of party poppers. Potential boss coming up. 
Limpet plus. It looks definitely looks like a boss. Yeah, it looks ominous, right? Ah, right, what do we got? We just got a shortcut here too. Oh, you know what? It's our uh, it's our lobster buddy. What's up, lobster buddy? Titan, you're alive. Did thou think I'd be slain so easily? Feh. What brings you further into these depths, vagabond? I'm still looking for treasure, I guess, but like a different one. Indeed, so you feel it too. The power that lurks down here in these depths. The sort of strength I've been seeking all along. I must unearth it. Use it to bring ruin on the tyrants of this ocean. Well, not if I get there first. Ah, that's the spirit. Now we are talking, little crab. Our souls must clash and let them clash not as enemies, but as worthy rivals. Onward, destiny awaits. Okie dokie. Another item up here. I really wish I knew where I, all I need is one more uh, stainless relic and I could upgrade my sword. I wish I knew where that was. Bard celebration. Uh, I don't know, dude. I thought maybe the yesterday we were about to beat the game and it turns out there was this entire section. So I don't even, I have no idea how long this game is. As far as I'm concerned, this game has earned it. It can be as long as it wants, as far as I'm concerned. This game can be as long as it wants. We're definitely gonna fight that person. Yeah, I'm probably gonna fight him at some point, right? I will grab another attack yeah! and oh, there's still 20 something shells we haven't seen. Let's go to the moon. Oh my goodness. Hi, 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 both of you. Hi cuties, hiccups, hi, <laughs> going mommy to the grocery store, have fun, oh so much fun. <laughs> All right, baby visit. Uh, let's see. Learn skills. Press R while aiming your spear at an enemy to grapple them instead. You're meant to deal a powerful br uh, blow. What is wave breaker? Let's go grab that. I think we're actually about to unlock everything here. What was this one? Releasing block while naked will let you parry as if you're wearing a shell. And last one. Okay. Circle of life. All right. So we've unlocked all the skills. Uh, keg teen kegs. Thank you for the eight months. Thank you, keg teen. Oh, I haven't scanned any QR codes in this. Okay. So we unlocked everything. Hold LT to aim an enemy, then press RB instead of releasing to grapple yourself towards the enemy and deal heavy umami damage. That's pretty cool. Um, do you also take the crystals to uh, the other guy too? Hang on, let me go to the other guy. We had a we had a bar baby emote for a while. Let's go here. I think there may be other th other ways to upgrade. Right, if you go to this guy. Yeah, I haven't done, like, any of this with this guy. Ah, right. I have. Yeah, I don't have enough. I've spent everything on the other thing. I really should uh, upgrade some of these. Should upgrade some of these. So there's, there's double use out of crystals. Okay. Let's go back to the... It kind of looks like there might be, like, one more area, maybe. Maybe one more area in the game. Bar baby was a good emote. Seriously, Splatoon 3. Seriously, Splatoon 3. Why Splatoon 3? I don't know why. I don't care. <laughs> I'm just, I'm not looking forward to it though. Well, if you're a daytime watcher, You've now been fully vindicated that I don't think anybody will ever make the claim that nighttime marbles pick better games than daytime. I don't think that will ever, that claim will ever be made again. Are we like inside a, a shark? Inside a big old shark. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. You're certain we're going the right way? How should I know? Think I spend my weekends here, do you? Well, then what the shuck am I still paying you for? 
Matter of fact, we're in this mess cause you couldn't defeat a damn lobster. Good for nothing. I should have left you on the seabed where I found you, you little... <laughs> Enjoying the spoils, are you, lad? Proud of what you've done? Uh, look, man, I don't want anything from you. Please just leave me alone. I don't want to fight anymore. Please leave me alone. I don't want to fight anymore. But fight ye did. Just like me. Just like old Linkerton. And down here we've both drifted. Two worthless sinners. Right where we belong. The bottom of the train! Inkerton, Crab Hunter. Is he like literally wielding a gun? I think he is. What? Let's face hell together, lad. Ooh. God, that hurt. To the last, I grapple with thee. Pretty easy, pretty easy. He definitely did some big fucking damage more than once on me, but uh, not too bad. GG. Uh, Rubber Duck of War, thank you for the sub. Kuda Man, thank you for the sub. I feel like um, feel like that boss actually had a hard time hitting me because of like the collision of the arena and like the elevation. Like a lot of his attacks were just like missing me weirdly, so. But a win is a win. We take those. Yeah, dude, that guy was easier than the snow crabs. Yeah. Are you Sebastian's grandson? Is Ariel or Flounder in this game? No. <laughs> we did get the key. Yeah, it definitely felt like some of his attacks, like, that probably should have hit me, like, didn't, you know? When he did hit me, he did, like, almost half my life and were, like, over half my life in one hit. Okay. Yeah, I want to go upgrade my uh, weapon again. 69 months. Nice. 
Uh, thank you very much, uh, Poly Guitar, for 69 months. Really appreciate that. I dare not posture what lies ahead, but the only way forward is well forward, I say. And truly, the perfect world is close at hand, or close at claw. How do you know that? And uh, what am I looking at? This looks like a dead end. It's a lock, my lad. A lock can only be opened by two hermits like ourselves. Who needs a lock only hermit crabs can open? What's so special about us? Oh, my child. Perhaps one day I'll impress upon you the gravity of all that has been lost. But for now, see with your own eyes will do more than a mountain of expedition, I say. Follow my lead, like so. Oh, God. The hell is this? <laughs> the fuck is this? Uh, Dark Oblivion, thank you for the 19 months. Thank you, Dark Oblivion. The old ocean. The loathsome chum eater. <laughs> nice shot. Uh, Eternal Havoc, thank you for 34 months. That's thank all. you very much. The old ocean. I think I should be so honored to lay eyes on this place. The perfect world lies dormant somewhere near. I can feel it. It calls to us, to all hermits everywhere. Everyone that would see the ocean restored to its former glory. Don't lose your tempo now, I say. We're about to change the course of the world, child. Okay. Ha. The packing peanuts. Right? Hands down, Booba or Crabs. I like this game a lot more than Stellar Blade. I like this game a lot more. I didn't really care for Stellar Blade very much. Uh, I could level up. Let's go level up my resistance, I suppose. And uh, let's go warp back to the lower crust for upgrades. Yeah, I didn't really care much for Stellar Blade. I'm not impressed with it. Nothing good ever come a lesson at the power that ain't yours. Before long, you'll see the sense in putting down the sword and picking up a mount. Spend your time building, not fighting. Of course, I do my share of arming you fighters, don't I, Scrap? Upgrade my fork. Ooh, I got, like, fancy fork now. Get my fancy fork. I wonder if there's, a. Uh, I wonder if there's another upgrade. Is there another upgrade, we think? Apparently there is actually another upgrade to the fork. Apparently there is one more. Fuck only knows where the... I, I don't have any relics anymore. Uh, here, let's go back up to the surface. Ah, let's just go back. Fighting with the crab fork. Let's go back. I hope it finally looks like a trident. Uh, Alright, the old ocean bleached glade. Oh, did I ever break that dude out of the bottle? Uh, no, I can't remember where he was. I'd be curious to see what he got, what he gave me, but no, I never broke that dude out. Uh, he was somewhere in the, the poison area, if I recall. Somewhere in the poison area. Buy Amogus. Yeah, he was in the junkyard area, right? the map say okay not particularly helpful haven't seen any enemies around here yet the 
trident would be sick. Seems kind of end gamey. Yeah, kind of, right? Oh, this is an enemy. husk we've already we've already seen the crab husk shell before fuck you Sick Nintendo 64 cards you got there? Yeah, man, I love it. <laughs> it has a ton of HP, too. an asshole. So whenever you kill these enemies, they pop out of their shell and they're like a baby crab, I guess. It causes them to molt. Interesting. What are my thoughts on this game so far? Uh, this game has been like a lot better than I thought it was going to be. It's a ton of fun. Please. Definitely, uh, definitely recommend this game. Grub Aggie? A strong ass scrub. It flossed. Hey, you know what I can do? Let's go make a hammer. I can beat somebody with my Nintendo 64 hammer. <laughs> Hell yeah, dude. Uh, thank you, Midas Whale, for the 21 months. Really appreciate that. Yeah, this game is good. It's a lot better than I thought it was going to be. The bosses are cute. Uh, the world is, you know, well-made and fun. The story, even the story is kind of weirdly good. Kind of feels like a story that could have been pretty easily developed into, like, a Pixar movie, like an animated movie. Uh, you know, it's, it's just a cute, it's cute. It's a good game. Better barnacle than you have? Uh, yeah, maybe. At some point you have to decide what you're putting on here, like what you want to do. Um, it, it could be, I don't know. I could mix up my stuff. I'm not really sure what I would do with my stuff, but I could mix it up. Don't bullshit me. Ow! Found the newly hidden Twitch Prime sub button. Ooh, man. What the fuck? <laughs> so I'm I'm stuck with this thing clamped onto my ass. I can't get it off. Uh, PMP, thank you for the 27 months. Thank you very much. Uh, yeah, yeah. They they kind of hid the Twitch Prime button. Button. If you want to know where to find the Prime button, you can use the exclamation point Prime in the chat, and that will tell that will tell you where it is. Another new shell. It's like a big, it's like a big laundry detergent cap. Miyazaki's taking notes. 
Oh, man. Dude, I am getting fucking wrecked. Let's run. Run! Today it's my birthday. So here's Twitch Prime. I got a toilet paper roll there. Uh, hang on. One sec. Uh, Evil Possum, thank you for 40 months. Linu Turk, thank you for the 24 months. Happy birthday, man. I hope it's a good one. Lutch, thank you for the brand new Twitch Prime. Greatly appreciate that. Thank you, dude. Happy Saturday. I hope your Saturday's going well. Uh, I think we're probably going to finish Crab Game, I think. And then after this, I'm not sure. Um, oh, ah, uh, shit. After that, we'll see. We'll see. Possibly some Fallout 2. Uh, not Splatoon 3, no. Splatoon 3, I, at the long list of stuff I have to do right now, Splatoon 3 is somewhere at the bottom of that list. I am a fucking idiot. Okay, that works for me. Like that, I am an idiot. You like my Sony cart? You like my hammer? You watched Fallout on Prime. Uh, I have watched Fallout. I have. We finished it yesterday. Uh, overall, really enjoyed it. Very fun. I feel like there's a number of fan bases out there, including myself, and I look at it and I like grit my teeth, and it kind of pisses me off. Not because there's anything wrong with Fallout, because I actually think it's a good show. To me, it's like, man, why couldn't you fucking make Lord of the Rings decent? Like, why couldn't you fucking make uh, Halo decent? You know, like, I, I don't know, man. It's crazy to me that they, they hand these really, these great franchises with tons of potential and they hand them over to, like, people who not only, like, dislike it, but they fucking hate, they hate these franchises. They hate them, right? Yeah. Or The Witcher, for that matter. The Witcher's another one that they fucking hate The Witcher, right? Why? Why do you do this? You think it's expectations? No, I think there's literal. Like, I, I think that if you have, I, I, I'm sure that there are some Fallout fans who are like annoyed or irritated by the show. Like, I have no doubt that it's not like 100% every single Fallout fan loves the show. I have no doubt that there's, there's probably some Fallout fans who are annoyed. But I think that if I've seen Rings of Power, I've seen The Witcher, I've seen Fallout, and like just the. It's, it, it's pretty much just strictly quality. Like nobody cares if it's act, if it's like faithful to it. As long as the quality is there, really. Like you can you can make you can tell your own stories. You can make up your own stuff without pissing on something, right? Mortal Kombat fans. The problem with Rings of Power is that it's fucking terrible. That's like the number one problem. And yeah, it's a whole fucking mess. Dude. Would have been so bad to give it to somebody who like do you, can you you can't even block while you have this thing on by the way you can't even block you actually can't even do anything there Oof. Man. 
League of Legends. I know I'm salty. I'm salty. I will I will be salty that they like for some reason it's like luck of the draw based on who what writers and what creative teams got access to these things. And you gave you gave Lord of the Ring, which is like an amazing franchise, to fucking Tweedledee and Tweedle fucking Dumb apparently, and they and they shit all over it. And then you give Fallout to people who actually know what they're doing, and lo and behold, you actually get a decent show. What do you know? Boom, bitch. Uh, any change can be done if it's good. And yeah, I mean, Jackson's Lord of the Ring movies did their own little things here or there. And I'm then again, there were Lord of the Rings fans back today who were like mad about changes. But like overall, the Lord of like the Lord of the Rings movies have stood the test of time, regardless of the changes. So, okay, so what is this? Can I can I grab this? Yeah, I, I seem like I can't grab the toilet paper. Uh, I didn't watch the Halo show, but I don't think any Halo fan is happy about the Halo TV show. I'm pretty sure. I, I don't know. Has anybody here watched the Halo show? I don't think I've heard a single person happy about the Halo TV show. The action actors involved uh, also like in Source Steel House. They really don't care to invest the time. The Halo show is fine. I uh, really, I've heard, I've heard nothing. I've actually heard this is the first I've ever heard anything positive about the Halo show. I've heard nothing but negativity about it. You're the, you're the first ones. I haven't watched it, so. The duality of Halo chat. Yeah, I've, I've heard nothing good about it. There's a lot of enemies here. League of Legends IP has great potential. I kind of feel like, uh, I don't know. I, I actually don't, I actually do not think it's that hard to please fans. And I, I don't think it's like all that hard, honestly. And so I got uh, new toilet paper. I don't think it's impossible. Did I ever see Arcane? I did not. Okay, we're gonna avoid the thing here. I, I've heard Arcane is really good, but it's really good. I haven't seen it though. Oh. Barbarize. Sir. I'm uh, Bird Doctor, thank you for the sub. Man. Climber King, thank you for the sub. Appreciate it. Thank you very much. I was I was listening to uh some people like it was like a YouTube video, it was a conversation about like the ways in which adaptations have changed. And how like in the past if you had like a video game adaptation or something like basically you would just take like if you think about like the original super mario movie how like yeah it has super mario but let's face it it's not particularly accurate and it's not close to super it doesn't feel anything like super mario right it's just this kind of weird mess like nobody really was that happy with overall like it has the stuff in there but really like they kind of jettisoned everything about it that made it like Mario and then did their own thing with it. I have a prescription bottle on me. Uh, Sammykins, thank you for the nine months. Thank you, Sammykins. Appreciate that. Um, and how like now it kind of seems like with adaptations, we're now moving more in the direction of adaptations that are somewhat faithful and uh, like they're actually trying. Yeah, it's Viagra. <laughs> <laughs> pretty funny like basically like the nature of adaptations have changed over time and how they're like becoming more faithful and uh you know like but with basically the way hollywood is doing these things is different now but kind of interesting i guess it's really like the mario movie i guess the, 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 the maybe the mario movie is like the biggest difference like compare the old mario movie to the new mario movie maybe that would be like the biggest a, a good way to compare the, the how the genre has changed i guess well, The Last of Us show was pretty fucking faithful to the game overall. It was pretty faithful. 
from what I remember anyway. No, I didn't see them. Yeah, I didn't see the Mario movie. I know. Yeah, Splatoon 3. I'm really excited. Is a zombie show, right? Well, it's not about doing it right or wrong. It's more so we're talking about like how faithful are they to the original source material and stuff. Whereas like the Halo TV show is extremely unfaithful, right? It's like, it's completely shit all over. Like whether you like it or not, it is doing, it's very much doing its own thing, right? Are we in that city? Of course we are. It's gonna be dangerous inside, right? Indeed, would you have it any other way, child? Admit it or not, you're an adventurer through and through. You could have easily left this place, I say. You know, empty hand, it wasn't enough for you. You've got ambition. I guess. Maybe I do. Now that ambition has brought us here, we can't possibly turn back now. We must fight to achieve our ambition, then we must fight. Of course, I mean you must fight. I'll meet you outside once you breach the gates. Okay. Season 1 wasn't the same storyline from the games. Nintendo was very involved with the Mario movie. Yeah, yeah, they wanted a bunch of changes and stuff, right? Is that a champagne glass? I, I really got to watch out for these teeth things. These teeth things suck. Uh, what the fuck is that? What the fuck? Holy, what the hell? <laughs> wow, what the fuck? Is this like the Radon bridge? Like, what is this shit? Holy fuck. Can you stop? I know I passed some crystals there, but I feel like I got to stop these things from shooting me. Uh, I'm trying to invade Normandy by myself. He's not a fan, but he's also not really played them. Which which one are we talking about? Uh, visual? What are we talking about? Elden Ring, I'm trying. Uh, yeah, exactly. Oh, well, I can't make that. Yeah, Viagra is what it's called, right? Oh, The Witcher. Yeah, I read the book. Uh, I read The Witcher book, and I, I played a small amount of Witcher 3. I just don't like The Witcher that much. I'm not a Witcher guy. I watched season one and two of The Witcher, and season one was like, it's all right. And season two, I thought was fucking awful. Like, oh my God, I hate it. Season two. But season two was miserable. Okay. You made an Elder Ring show, what would you do? Uh, I hope for the best, but prepare for the worst, I guess. <laughs> well, season one, glad I did not continue. What was the Marvels pick yesterday? Uh, you can use expectation point Marvels and it'll always give you the answer. Bro, can these things stop shooting me? Like, oh, what are these things? What is shooting me? I don't know what's shooting me, but I don't know whatever's shooting me, but I hate it a lot. God, I really hope these fuckers don't respawn. Oh, so these things like... It's like they damage your shell or something. Oh, 
Fuck off. I really hope these guys don't respawn. Claw bands? Is that what they're using for their bow and arrow, right? Uh, there's a sham so there's a soda can here. A champagne flute. Ring a ding. What does ring a ding do? Okay, interesting. Oh, that opened the gate. Okay. Hang on. Before we do that, I'm going to go back this way because there was crystals over there. And there's a shortcut here. Shit. Uh, I can understand Sekiro, but as an anime, but not as a live action. Um, I don't think... I guess I'll have to come back and warp back later to get those crystals. All right, fair enough. Uh, I'm playing this on PC. Apparently, this game's on Switch, PS5, like Xbox, on everything, I guess. So. Was my only uh my only shell uh that guy jumped off and killed himself and gave me nine thousand souls okay <laughs> sure I'll take it uh forgot about andrew thank you for forgot about drew thank you for the uh buying a shirt appreciate it man I'm going to go swap to the scrubber here. It's got a lot more HP. Arsenia, the bleached city. All right, bye. Uh, do you enjoy this game? I am enjoying this game. This game has been a ton of fun. It's been a very enjoyable game. What's up, Whiskey Dingo? How's it going, dude? Alrighty. Uh, I kind of want to go back. How, how many crystals do I have right now? Let's see. I have 66. Okay, we're, I can level up. Let's go level up uh, Vitality, I suppose. Yeah. How's this game been? This game is really charming, man. It's really good. Let's go here. I want to get those crystals on the bridge. It's been a lot of fun. When's the new merch dropping? Uh, whenever I can get Sour Newt to uh, help me out with some stuff, and uh, he's a, he's a busy dude. Those fucking guys respawn? You're kidding! Come on, man! Can't believe those guys respawned. Well, at least I got the... That's what I came here for, was the crystals. And I died. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> I got the crystals, though. Uh, the most charming Souls-like game I have ever seen. Yeah, I mean... 
at what point does it does a game not longer does it no longer register as a souls like it starts to become like its own thing but i think i think like games like this and lies of p and uh, i think that th these games are, are pretty cool honestly and uh it's cool to see what they can do with the genre there's not really other weapons so what you do is you can either fight with the fork or what if you want to you can do a heavy attack and make your fork into a hammer so like if i do this now i have whoop, what? Oh, never mind. There was there was a dude in there. <laughs> Ow, fucker! God. Now, I, I, you know what? I guess you can't with this one. Never mind. Okay. Really not. Well, I'll show you the hammer as soon as I find something I can make a hammer. You know what? Actually, let's do this. Here, let's do this. And we'll make a Nintendo 64 hammer. There we go. <laughs> you wish to know what I am. I am a dream, little crab. Dreamt by every mind extinguished. Every rope strength. Ah. Every oil filled gill. Such uh, Shadow Chani, thank you for 29 months. By the currents and spin until they reach the bottom of the bottom, down where all things go. You will reach it too soon enough. The story of Liza P is literally stolen. I don't think it's stolen. It's that the the Pinocchio is in the public domain and it's retelling. I don't think stolen is the right. Like it's not like. It's not like plagiarizing, trying to pass something off of its own, right? Yeah, I don't think that's quite stolen. That's not That's not what that is. It's wrong. And Liza P is quite good. Quite a good game. Ready? Ooh, what is that? Boom! Disney stole right, so if if Lies of P is stolen, is Pinocchio stolen? Because that was originally an Italian novel, right? Is that also stolen? A dish scrubber. Twist top. Ready? These guys are blowing bubbles at me. Fuck you. Everything inspired by or based on something? Dude, when Shakespeare wrote Julius Caesar, he stole from Roman history. <laughs> it's, just, it's just dumb. Uh, Disney owns the word stolen, you must pay. Oh my god, he did. Only stole a version where Drew Carey played Geppetto. What's up, Wiley Bombi? How's it going? Everybody knows Shakespeare stole from Marlowe. Oh, no. Yeah, where am I? Stop! Boy, I don't like these enemies. Those those puffer fish enemies. That's like my least favorite enemy, I think, in the whole fucking game. <laughs> I hate that enemy. Okay. What the fuck? These are uh, certainly clipping into the walls, aren't they?
You were figuring out what the X spots are for. Uh, I think the X spots are where the tube worms come out and like try to kill you, right? What the fuck was that? Forming. Fabrizio, thank you for the 40 months. Thank you very much. So bald K E K W. <laughs> Ow, fucker. What? What the fuck? <laughs> He's stuck. Okie dokie. Just having fun. Yeah, he's just having fun bouncing around. Okie dokie. Motherfucker. God. Assholes. Yeah, chest here. See a shortcut over there. Uh, is this a Marvels game? Marbles. Is this a Marbles game? No. There's also a command of exclamation point marbles. You can use that anytime to see whether or not or what the current Marbles game is. Big Chungus boy, I got no heals. This game was legit. Have you played Planet Crafter? Lots of fun. No, I never played Planet Crafter. It's like something down there. Oh, we were here earlier. We just did like a big circle all the way around. I guess that what going there got me the stainless steel, I guess. And let's go back. Let me go back. I think I missed something else. You guys still heard over Splatoon 3? Uh, I don't know if anybody's heard over it, but... Uh, uh, I'm not sure if I can... I don't know. I see the lobster buddy up there. I don't know how to reach that person, though. Okay, go back down here. Oh, what the fuck was that? Whoa. Whoa! Oh, man. Dude, it just carried me right off. Else getting low. Uh, crumbling Mare Azula. <laughs> it is kind of far in Azula right now, isn't it? Uh, I don't like this enemy. Do you want? All right, let's fight him. Uh, let's go whoopsie daisy wrong button. Let's go swap to this 
Use that for a heal. Okay. Fish scrubber attack is great. Yeah, the scrubber attack's pretty good. All of the shells in the game all have like their uses, it seems. I think like the freeze one to pop the ice cone, that was probably one of the Oh shit. That was probably like the worst one I saw. That one seemed kind of worthless to me. Well, that guy dropped the heal. All right, let's go. This game has been very entertaining. I'm glad you've enjoyed it. I've definitely enjoyed playing it. Like the first hour, like the first hour and a half for like hour, two hours, I'd say be a little patient with the game because uh, it's a little slow. But after like the first like hour or two, it really picks up and then it's, uh, it's a lot of fun beyond that point. So just be a little patient with it right off the bat. What's the GoldenEye Remix? GoldenEye Remix. I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, it's a Lego brick. Yes, it is. Okay, shortcut. Go grab this. After be raising your marbles pick, this with this might be a landmine. You know, people pick what they want to pick, and you know, that's the results we get sometimes. What can I tell you? Can I tell you, man? Where's the demon bell? You know, uh, you know, the game picks up right after you have MSG. Yeah, once you like, you gotta get the shell, then you get the special abilities, and uh, where did that fucking shit send my ass? Jesus Christ. No, I thought about land mining Splatoon, but it's like, whatever, I'll play Splatoon 3, I guess. Yet. <laughs> I swear to God, that literally is the attack of the Crucible Knights. Why am I so against Splatoon? Uh, I mean, it's irritating. It looks really, it looks, sounds very irritating is why i don't like splatoon i haven't played it maybe the gameplay will be like oh my god i get it i understand but uh yeah it's fucking annoying maybe when i play it maybe i'll maybe i'll be like oh my god this game's great i doubt it we'll see it's a game for irritating kids it's a weird choice uh, i mean I'm sure I have irritating children who watch me. I'm, I'm, I see them every Saturday. Is there a, a way... So there's here. So I can grapple across there. I feel like that's how we go forward. This area is very, uh, very far in Missoula, isn't it? I want to see what's uh, over here, though. Hey, fuck you, take it back. Is this a fucking snow globe? <laughs> Hell yeah, dude. I, uh, well, I'll say goodbye to that one, I guess. I guess I'm stuck with a snow globe. Uh, the snow globe special is freeze, which I haven't had freeze like do anything for me. Uh, I don't know. It seemed not great, but uh, maybe maybe I was using it wrong. Maybe I don't understand. I haven't used freeze since we had the waffle cone like a million years ago. It's been a while. Okay. 
freeze into Mantis Punch. Uh, maybe. There might, be, there might be some really good combos. I don't know. Vagabond. Titan. How'd you make it down here? By following the call, just like you. You seek the whirl as well, I assume. The divine weapon of the old ocean, forged by ancient claws. How do you know so much about it already? And hold on, it's not a weapon, right? The old guy made it sound like some powerful magical doodad. I knew a little before I came to this place, but I've learned much in little time. Knowledge untold wraps every wall and pillar of this place, I, if one cares to look. Make no mistakes, Vagamon. An item of power and a weapon are one and the same. Our enemies do not so much as hesitate to turn power into violence, so neither must we. Why don't we use it to hurt people? I just want to, like, make things better. And I want my shell back. Listen to you, Vagamon. So far, I stray from your original goal. When will you seize control of your own rudder? Will you ever? If we meet at the center of this maze with whirl and claw. I sincerely hope it may align on its use and meet as friends. Am I your friend? I see my point is lost on you. Do we meet again, Vagabond? Wait, wait. Do you know where you're going? Follow the call, little hermit. Let yourself be dragged by the spiral deep inside. You know how. I'm tugging on you all your life, after all. Okay. Friend? <laughs> you want to see me suffer? You knew what you were doing. Oh, OX. Yeah, he's uh, he's still banned from marbles. Okay, I just fell way back down. He's banished from marbles. There we go. used to be a Mario stream. Who is this who speaks to me as if he, I needed his advice? Ah! Fuck you. Yeah, Freeze, uh, I don't know, man. I don't think Freeze feels all that great. I don't know if I like Freeze at all. Swap to the coffee mug. Ah, oh, you fucking asshole. Could it stack? I'll, like, keep doing Freeze? Uh, I don't know, maybe. Hammer back, please. <clears throat> See a up oh, with that shit. Fuck you. All that for 250 microplastics. I could go that way. Uh, let's go try to grab the bonfire first. Uh, you play at 120 FPS on a jailbroken PS4. Uh, is he banned for marbles? He's banned for five more marbles races. <laughs> yeah, he's banned from marble racing. He gets timed out right before we run the marbles race. Let's see, what's over here? Music makes you want to play Metroid. And meow. Oh, this just charges me up. So those are on a timer, okay. To go back and spend all my crystals here. One of the thoughts on Blasters 1 and 2, been really loving the Green Beans playthrough. Is that the new SpongeBob Skull, uh, SquarePants? No, this is not a SpongeBob game. <laughs> This game is called Another Another Crab's Treasure. It's like kind of 
Soulsy, sort of, not really. Uh, and uh, I, I was, I was kind of gonna skip this game. Wasn't really looking forward to it. Decided to play it because chat kept asking me to play. I was like, all right, I'll check it out. Why not? And uh, the beginning is a little slow, but this game has been really charming. Really, really charming. Uh, what are my thoughts on Blasphemous 1 and 2? I like Blasphemous 2 better than 1. But I'm not really a Come massive on, fan of either. Me. Not really a huge fan of either game. I do like Blasphemous 2 a little bit better, though. Uh, Oscar, thank you for 34 months. Thank you very much. Really appreciate that. Uh, thank you, Oscar. that enemy like a lot <laughs> um and them crystals here about the last no blasphemous it's the 2d scrolling game 2d kind of metroidvania uh very dark aesthetic like uh spanish very catholic style okay can i uh oh i was gonna say can i ride this up and the answer is yes okay cool Blast of us. Blasphemous lore is great. You think so? I couldn't tell you a fucking thing that happened in Blasphemous. <laughs> I couldn't I couldn't tell you a fucking thing about the lore of that game. Uh let me go level up MSG. A little MSG there. I couldn't tell you a fucking thing, man. No idea. Penitent one. Uh, we're gonna go here and go level up, uh, some of my attacks here. Oh, it was actually, it was all actual, well, it's like fake Catholicism. It's not like real, it's not like actual based in Catholicism. Okay, I think the one I use the most is probably, uh... Let's see. The shell spell. So I guess I must have leveled up the claw to max, huh? Guess I already did that. Damage over time. The double bullet, level three. The claw is the one I use the most, I feel like. Let's level up this one. And uh, we'll level up the mantis punch also. Okay. Uh, so let's try, we'll try the bullets too. Damn, that's pretty cool. Okay. Everything sucks and everything is terrible. You actively aggressively ignore lore if you can no surprise there. I, I don't, I, I don't think you're being fair to me. Blasphemous is very intentionally like, man, you gotta really, really try to keep up with Blasphemous lore. Okay, give me a break there. I, I think that you're you're vastly underselling how fucking vague and confusing that game is. It just throws you right in. It doesn't make any sense at all. And you like really, you have to read like, as you go around, you pick up like the tooth of Saint Garble Darble and like the femur of Jimble Dingle and, and you got to read all this shit and like piece it together. You think I'm going to sit there and fucking Charlie Kelly it and have like a Pepe Sylvia moment over Blasphemous? I'm good, man. Figuring out the lore is going to take me longer than actually just beating the actual game. I think I'll just beat the game and skip it. 
Especially considering, like, I don't think my audience is really going to be like, oh, man, let me sit down and watch this guy try to figure out the story of Blasphemous. I don't think my audience is going to sit there and watch that. So why don't you shove it up your fucking ass, bitch? If that was all done, you'd be a shaky jungle trail all about leveling up. When there's a story, I pay. I, when there's a story and there's something actually intelligible, I'll sit there and I'll figure out. I'll, I'll read the story. I'll figure out what's going on. When you're talking about Blasphemous story, go fuck yourself. You're just wrong. I love it here. Uh, what math class did you take in college? Uh, well, I mean, I was uh, I was an English major and a history minor, so I took my requirements and I was done. You've been following the entire. I know that I can tell you every single every single plot point in the crab game. I can tell you literally everything about the story of this game. Uh, GG. I I think I forgot some of the characters' names, but you know, so be it. <laughs> Uh, where does this go? Oh, this just get this. That's all that is. Okay. It starts with the lore of the legendary vibrator. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm going this way. Back. Ah. <laughs> It's really hard to play games when you're fucking sneezing, dude. Think it's a bad day for allergies. Oh, what the fuck? Bullshit. What kind of horse shit? What's that as this triangle? I don't know, actually. Say scurvy? No. That shit. Car claw. Scoured. Oh, okay. I think what it does is it, uh, it, it like seriously damages your shell, which, you know, it's not like that big of a deal. I regret not taking linear algebra in college. She just using so many things. I took uh, some kind of college algebra and some kind of statistics or something. God, dude, every shell I pick up, there's already a fucking asshole in it. Oh, no, there was a trap there is what it was. Well, that's what it was. You like, you just can't get this thing off you at all, can you? What happens if I uh, parry? So I need the mantis punch here to get through. Yeah, uh, math was a, a very long time ago. Imagine my surprise when I, I go to teach high school and they're like, oh, also you have to teach uh, SAT math, by the way. Imagine my fucking surprise, man. <laughs> like, excuse me. Uh, did uh, I did the best I could, put it that way. Let's see, check out Matrix Calculus. Uh, yeah, I mean, I'm not really too interested in math overall. You have to be, uh, I think you gotta be a special, a special duck to keep up with math once you're done with school. Certainly there are people who like to do that, but, uh, I will pass personally. Is it a, all right, here's a question. Would I be more into math if, like, maybe I had better teachers, because there are i can say from a historical perspective from a history perspective people like hate history 
But it's not because you don't like history. It's because your history professors and, and teachers were fucking terrible. You know, teachers make all the difference. To me, math was always so fucking dry and like pointless. Fuck you. Uh, Manon, thank you for 30 months. Digi Domo, thank you for the sub. Appreciate it. Thank you very much. Lost is bad and you should feel bad. Uh, deflated pair, thank you for the 59 months. Uh, thank you very much. Appreciate that. I despise math with a passion. Uh, I also think math class structure is a way to make the average person bad at math. They care more about you memorizing formulas, computational methods, and the actual learning of why math works. Hmm. Maybe. Uh, from the point of view of history, Um, the way history works is that there were, there was viewed like the stuff that you like have to learn, like you have to know about this stuff. So you like, you'd spend a lot of time learning about like what we call great man history, where it's a whole shitload of like this king, you know, this person, this person, this battle, this war. And for a lot of people that was, uh, understandably pretty fucking dry and, uh, you know, you just kind of drift from one king to the next, to the next, to the next, and after a while, you just kind of like, well, ugh, like, who cares about this, right? Uh, now that, uh, that's point of view, and that has, um, uh, I think that's still around. You still kind of have to learn about those, that aspect of history, but then it's not as, uh, critical as it once was. As critical as it once was. Uh, I just clipped right through the elevator there. Clipped right through. Yeah. Uh, what it mean when can't poop? Thank you for the 500 bits. Thank you very much. Appreciate that. Like how bar broke open the wall and never went to go check it out. I did. I broke up. I did not see myself. I didn't see myself broke up on a wall. Oh, the mantis punch. I must have got distracted by something. I don't know what. Yeah, I remember breaking open a wall. Old world whorl. A shell from forgotten time. Umami charges increased. Oh, okay. So we got uh, more magic. Ooh. Mr. Dry's most boring subject in school. Prove me wrong. EDTA killer. What's your favorite? What's like your favorite like subject? What's like your favorite thing? I'll prove you wrong right now. It's easy. What's like your favorite thing? This game on console? Yeah. Yeah, this game's on console. I'll prove you wrong immediately. It's not even hard. When this guy's resigned chapters and highlight important parts, and then I learned nothing. I was trying to remember the info to pass. Yeah, I mean, a lot of a lot of history teachers also are like they're not history, like they're not specialized in history. They're like the fucking volleyball coach. So it's like, oh man, I hate history because you were taught. Yeah, because you were taught by a fucking volleyball coach who doesn't know shit about history. <laughs> That's partially why. That was your football coach, right? Yeah. See another item down there. Let's go drop down. The game is dumping, dumping souls on me right now. Uh, what happens if I do this? I didn't find out until college there was a Roman general who catapulted the basket scorpions in Egyptian boats during a naval battle. What is that doing? 
That explains Trump at Gettysburg. That's not fair. One of the best people to know is also the best basketball coach I know. My point is that if if you were to take somebody off the street and something, hey, go teach algebra. And you'd be like, well, what's your specialization? Well, I'm, I, I teach wrestling. And that person didn't know shit about algebra and they just looked at a textbook. How good of a teacher do you think that person is going to be about algebra? Odds are, you know, maybe you'll find somebody who maybe, maybe, maybe a couple of those random people you find, maybe they actually won't be good at teaching algebra. Maybe they'll actually pick it up. I, I would wager that the vast, the vast majority of those people are going to be fucking terrible at it though. The vast majority. If you have somebody who walks in and doesn't know shit about history, you throw them in to teach history. They're not enthusiastic about it. They don't know shit. They're relying on a textbook. They have nothing to add or to offer. You know, like history, like if you have that background knowledge, you can like add in all these fun details about it and like make it interesting for uh, for students, like engage them with it. So. Test taking and bad teachers are why history is a subject people don't like. You say that about every subject. Right, right. But for some reason for history, it's like, oh, well, anybody can teach history. Why not? This guy doesn't know shit about history. Let's throw him in there. Sure, why not? That's because history gets shit on. And then you wonder why, like, media literacy, knowledge of the past. Like, if you ask, if you ask a bunch of average kids, like, hey, what was World War II about? Why did World War One happen? Like, why is, uh, what was Vietnam about? Like, like you ask people, they're gonna be like, duh. And even, even more recently, right? Like, hey, what happened on 9-11? And you're gonna find kids who are like, I don't know, like some kind of attack or something. Was it, I what was it, Iraq or something? Like, you're not gonna, you're, you're gonna find like, oh my God, this is like horrifying actually. <laughs> like really horrifying. And there's a reason for that. There's a reason why. inside job history spoilers too real don't ask kids kids don't know anything i'm not going to tell you that history repeats itself because that implies we're going to make the same mistakes we did before what i will tell you is that we'll make all new exciting mistakes and we're going to just get dumber and dumber as to why the world is the way it is you know, the world didn't get the way it is. Like it is the way it is for a lot of reasons. And it's important to know those reasons. So, uh, infamous John Doe. Thank you for the 25 months. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. Uh, I think I've had the Mason jar before. Uh, I'm, I, I know I've been here before. I know I've been here. We're on top of this part. Definitely been here. Yeah. I don't know. I'm, I'm not sure what some of these drains are doing. I see an item over there. How's this area? Uh, this area has been cool. I'm, I'm glad there's more to the game because this, this, you know, this game is pretty awesome. Um. Definitely has some uh, Fara Missoula vibes. It's kind of funny. So that is lowering that. So we have to then run back up, I guess. We just, uh, now we're just riding this thing. TikTok. It kind of feels, yeah, it's a bit like Fara Missoula, right? This, uh, this looks like fucking Aner Londo right there. Look at that shit. <laughs> Have we gotten Aner Londo? Yeah, it's right here. Shortcut. 
Oh, God. Son of a fucking... Fuck you. You're only at 50% of the game. How many poison swamps have there been? There's one poison swamp area we've found so far. Is this game a good experience overall? Yeah, I've been having a great time with this game. It's been a lot of fun. The first like hour or two hours is a little slow, but after that point, it gets really good. Definitely, or I, I would definitely recommend this game. A lot of fun. Here we go back and beat the roaming boss. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. There's probably more bosses. I feel like there's probably more bosses in the world I've missed. Probably more. Probably have missed more bosses somewhere. Um. Ah. This is like the entrance. <laughs> Look at this fucking place. I should level up the Mantis Punch, dude. The Mantis Punch is pretty strong. It instantly knocked him down. Wow. Aqualondo. Time to battle Aldrich. This thing is definitely alive. Yeah. Fuck you. I'm out of here. Um, anything down here? My sword is bad. Ah, you like my crab fork here? There is something down here. I guess there's another upgrade. Uh, you can upgrade the sword again. Um, I don't know. I, I think I'm missing four steel pieces for the sword. I think one more upgrade is probably the. It's probably it at that point. What kind of a spork is? It's like a crab fork, right? Oh my god. I feel like I'm about to fight Ornstein and Smo in here. It feels a lot like in Orlando. <laughs> Throne room. Of course it had to be here. Stealing the world from the sorcerers wasn't enough for the king. He had to lock away or he alone could touch it. I doubt he could even wield it. Designed for hermits alone, after all. How very, very foolish. I must have missed something to you, child. This city is no ancient relic. As a matter of fact, I spent my childhood here a mere 30 years ago. Holy crap, you're 30 years old? I didn't even know it was possible to live that long. You're older than my shell. This is why I didn't want to tell you. I knew you'd make fun of me. But yes, I remember the king's persecution of the hermit sorcerers. I remember the coral decaying and fracturing, the city falling to pieces. My parents, passing me to a stranger, allowed me to flee without them. And the founding of a new city where we started over again. I've watched us slowly repeat our mistakes like nothing ever happened. I spent my years researching, hoping I might recover the perfect coral and save new Carcinia from the old city's fate. I think that in my twilight years, the chance might be offered to me. How could I not believe in destiny after that? So new Carcinia is really screwed without us. I get why you were so desperate for me to come with you. We're so, so very close. It's all been leading up to this. Go forth, child, and seize the opportunity between your claws. Okay. Uh, ODZ, thank you for 64 months. Greatly appreciated. Thank you, ODZ. Hermit crabs can live for 20 to 30 years. Seems like a long time. Thing down here. Up 
to 40 years or more. Wow. The green crab is going to be the final, but you think he's going to be the boss? Yeah, I don't know. Maybe. How has this game been? It's been very cute. Been a very cute game. Had a good time with it. Uh, let's grab uh, a, some life. Sure. And uh, let's go. Uh, I, I, I don't have that many crystals. I guess I'll wait. Oh, God. Oh, there's like traps all over the place here, too. Kamsha, the Bleached King. sent me way out there. Oh. Oh, what? Okay, GG. Pretty straightforward. Pretty, uh, well. He's going to come out of his shell, isn't he? Yeah, there he is. <laughs> Hamsha reborn. You know, this game, this game not so bad with the difficulty, but you know what Remind fucks you up in this game? Overconfidence is a slow the fucking and grab attacks killer. in this game are brutal, man. The grab attacks in this game are nasty as fuck. Uh, alright. Those, those grab attacks are no fucking joke.
Oof. So I don't know what it means when you get bleached. I don't know. I don't know what getting bleached means. So that when he when he jumps like that, also shockwave. Jeez, man, these hitboxes. Wow, I didn't realize that I was trying to heal. He can actually knock it out of your hands. I did not realize that. idea pop this back to the bubble bullet Okay, GG. Vadi should do a lore video on how this all adds up. I would watch a lore video on this game. I'd watch it. <laughs> that guy was uh, weird. That guy was weird to fight. Okay. This uh, toilet bowl we found. Going into that. Are we jumping into the toilet bowl? <laughs> all right, sure. The bottom of the drain. Oh. 
It's the abyss again. This game is cool. This game is cool. So that's the spiral, right? Rekindle the poop flame. My God, this is it. This is it, Krill. They all told me it was just a legend. Those buffoons. The perfect world. Do you know what this means, child? The archaeological community will never be the same, I say. With the proper funding, perhaps we can begin to learn the secrets of the ancient hermits. And then it's only a matter of time before... Oh, God damn it! Drivel. Titan! Oh my God! He's... He's dead! You killed him! Time, he says. The old idiot. Time is something we have none of. We're already much too late. Tides upon tides upon tides too late. This ocean was eaten up before I was even an egg. What? Why, why did you do that? He didn't do anything wrong! We are beyond saving. Soon we'll share the same fate as the old ocean. The world has only one use now. To punish this ugly world. To rip it asunder. You think you can wield it? In your complacent claws, it's no better than a rock. And you're no better than them. No better than the ones who ate this world up. To think. We really thought you could be our shell. I could vomit. You were not Kitan. How can you stand it? How can you sleep? How can you even breathe? You've seen how this ocean's been maimed. The agony it's in. The future that was stolen from us. You've seen everything we wanted you to see. So where's your anger? Where is your rage? Doesn't this pain boil you inside, little crab? Doesn't it just make you want to shocking scream? <laughs> Praia Dubia, the ocean's agony. What am I doing? Oh. Help me. Dark Souls 2 fucking sucks, and you know it. What the fuck? Uh, happy fuzz. Thank you for the sub. Ah! What the fuck is that?
Like a big claw, yeah. You, uh, you coming down? two for sure two phase two bosses in a row what is oh Die yeah you're right with the rest of this ocean Holy shit. What the fuck? What do I do? Am I supposed to die? Oh, am I just surviving? Oh, I just survived. Well, fuck. <laughs> I guess I just survived. Fuck, man. I didn't, I realized, I didn't realize until it was too late. Oh, let's beat him with the Nintendo 64 cartridge. All right. Yeah, I did not survive. I didn't realize that the health was going down at all. I didn't realize that. I did not survive there. You fucker. Dude, fuck you. You let them devour this world. You didn't lift the claw to stop them. <laughs> I wonder if you can get her in uh in one cycle there. Fuck. Fuck you. Uh. Damn it. Okie dokie. 
This will be a fun GDQ game. I just like invincible phases on boss fights. Uh Die with the rest of this ocean! Okay, we know now, like, survive. Ah! Ah! Whoa, ow, fuck. Uh, we're halfway there. Ah, uh, serpentine. Okay, interesting. GG. That's current. Okay, cool. Phase three. <laughs> that is a lot of crystals. That is a lot of crystals. Once you're in the scene, there's no going back. The game will no longer save. Be sure to make any preparation need for the final confrontation. Oh, okay. Well, thank you for the warning. Uh, all right, so I guess this is like whatever is about to happen is the end. We'll level up our attack one more time. Um, I suppose let's go back to the garden here. Let's go level up our moves. Okay. Time to become buffed, boy. Uh, let's see. Upgrade the mantis punch. Sure, do that, do that. All right, upgrade all these. Free the guy in the jar. I would, I don't remember where he is though. <laughs> I don't remember where the guy in the jar is. I know he's in the, uh, I know he's in the thing. I'm missing a major side boss. Really, am I? I don't know where it is. I mean, I know I miss, I, I know for a fact, I definitely miss stuff in the game. I know, I know I haven't seen everything. Um. So, the guy that was trapped was somewhere here. I don't remember where, though. I don't remember where. It was beside a bonfire. Yeah, he's stuck in the jar. I don't know where he is. Replay with 100%. Is this game shrimple or clamplicated? Where do you sell your stuff? Uh, you sell your stuff at the uh, lower crust over here. I also, th there's another weapon upgrade. I don't know where the upgrade is for the, the final weapon upgrade. I don't know where that is at all. Yeah, this is the dude where you sell your crap. Uh, so I can sell all these, sell all these, sell all these. A lot of souls here. 202,000 souls. Ha <laughs> ha uh, why go back in 100% this game? Uh, I, I could see playing this game again at some point. Same. This game is tight. Side boss pretty easy because it's not locked behind a quest. Uh, yeah, I have no idea where that is. No clue. Uh, let's get all attack. Everything on attack. A no hit run of this game. That'd be pretty funny to see. I'm sure somebody will do it. Uh, would you like to know? Uh, sure, go ahead. I have no idea where it would be. Sideboss probably also in the, in the poison swamp. Go ahead, tell me where he is. Where is he? Dev should add a randomizer. Probably a shellless run of this game. 
east of the emerald veil there is a, a breakable block the emerald veil emerald veil where's that the secret boss i guess there's a boss i missed somewhere Oh, where you fight the samurai crab? Uh, so that was here. Like, east of here? More around here? I like when Barb actually asks, well, people are like, oh, tell you, well, just come on, come on, do it. Like, All right, I'll do it. So somewhere around here, he said east. How did that guy die? Am I just killing guys just by running into them? When did I gain that ability? I'm so strong. Is it around here? I'm too powerful. I have no idea. I have a green aura. Yeah, I don't know what that's about. Stars, I'll never tell you. Yeah, I know you won't. Whoops, see Daisy. All right, I don't know where it is. People are like, I missed the boss, but I don't know where it is, and they're not helping, so fuck it. Uh, all right, let's go back. I don't know where it is. I don't know. I don't know where to find it. I uh, no, there's a yeah. I don't know how I was damaging those guys. Um, let's go. Let's head back. Yeah, there's obviously still stuff I did not do in the game, uh, but I don't know where it is. I don't really, I don't know if I really feel like scouring over every inch of the game again. So, yeah, I don't know. I mean, I asked, I, I don't know. They, they said go here and there's, I don't see anything. So, uh, I kind of want to go back to what I was doing. Okay. It's fun to explore. It is, but I also want to see what happens in here. I want to see what happens. All right, let's continue. Do it. Kaiden! Are you okay? I... I... Uh, I killed him. The old man who never raised a claw against me. I was the strong, wielding death against the weak. There is no salvation for me now. It wasn't you, Kaiden! It was... whatever that thing was, making you evil! A great confluence of damned souls. <laughs> a grim slurry of umami. My body moved at its whim. True. But the anger was mine. The hate was mine. <laughs> Without it, it could not have taken me as a shell. Stop talking! You're... you're going to be okay. All right? Perform me a favor, vagabond. <laughs> My anger was too much for me. But do not let it vanish. If you can, take my anger with you and wield it where it is needed to protect this world. Stop it! Stop talking like you're going to die! I didn't even... I didn't even like you guys when I met you. But He's got the I quivering eyes. Go. I, I don't want to be alone again! The confluence was wrong. There's still time to save this ocean. I must believe this. <laughs> Even if it is a lie, I will believe it. Until the day this all ends. Wait, wait, wait! That old guy was saying that shell has a lot of magic in it, right? I'll just put it on. Maybe I can heal you. Krill. Just, just stay right there. I'll be right back. Whoa, what happened? I put on this cool looking shell and for some reason I feel super great now. Like I could take on the whole ocean. Kind of like anything I want can become reality, you know? This is going to change everything. I'm going to be a hero. Blue, I, Firth, I need that shell to save Kitan. Can I put it on for a second? Kitan, who's that? Whatever you need, it can wait, pal. I'm thinking big right now, and my big things are going to save New Carcinia. Yeah, yeah, that's a great idea. Great thinking, me. Let's do it. What? Oh, no, 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 no. 
no, no, no! Just stay right there, Kaiku. I'll be right back. Oh God, it's gonna be bowed. <laughs> what the fuck? Where the shell did that current send me? We're above the water. Is this the huge trash island? One that drops all the trash on the city. Whatever. I've got to find Firth and get him back. Get me that shell back. There's still time to fix this, dude. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> There's seagulls and shit. Trash Island. Oh, God. Nutrition packs. Calorie. Hey there, pal. No hard feelings about our little disagreement earlier, right? My new powers are crazy. I just moved this whole island directly over New Carcinia. Looks like Trash Day came early. Pretty cool, right? Firth, I really need that shell. Chitin's hurt bad. I'll tell you who's hurt bad. The economy. That's who. With Roland gone and Scuttleport out of commission, our whole city's gonna completely collapse. And not only that, folks are starting to say the trash we've been using is physically harmful to us. Who would have thought? But it's all going to be okay. Now that I'm the god of this ocean, I've got a super genius three-step plan to save everyone. Step one, sink Trash Island onto New Carcinia, eliminating the whole concept of Trash Day. A permanent economic boom. What's better than that? You're going to cover this city in trash? Can we just talk about this? I just need to borrow the world for Step a minute. Step two, use that trash to usher New Carcinia into a second golden age. You'll see technology advance beyond your wildest dreams! You're not listening to me! And step three. With all that new tech, we'll form a plan to make New Carcinia's economy more sustainable. We ought to be able to start using 20% less trash within the next 200 tides or so. You thought I forgot about that part, didn't you? But I'm a caring guy. If you dump more trash on the reef, aren't they just gonna get gonked faster? And, and and I still need to save Chitin! So give me that shell! I'm not going to let you do this! That's the cool part about being a god. I don't need you to let me do anything. It's just gonna Oh happen. god. <laughs> what the fuck am I playing? Shit. I'll, I'll fight you for it! Huh, that's a bummer. I thought you had a good head on your shoulders, pal. I was really starting to respect you. But here you are, resorting to physical violence to take down an honest business class. No need to get angry, pal. You're only gonna get yourself hurt. I'm not! I... I am getting angry, aren't I? I think maybe... I've been angry the whole time. Ever since I left the tide pool, I never wanted to be. Everyone else seems angry all the time. I didn't want to be like that. But I can't help it. Not when people like you always get everything you want and other people get hurt for it. It's not fair. And I'm really strong now. Strong enough to stop you from making things worse. You really are quite white, you know. If you're gonna fight me, quit the sob story and just. You're gonna it. fight me with I've a got spoon. An empire to build here. Come on, do it. Hit me. Don't be a coward. Sonic. <laughs> Earth, the crab who stole the world. Like 
I don't know what's going on. <laughs> okay, all right. <laughs> the fuck is this? All right, well, uh, we'll wield the Nintendo 64 cartridge. Uh, oh, go this one. All right. Didn't watch my six. True. Come on, do it. Hit me. Don't be a cat. You're gonna regret standing in my way. What the fuck? Now like the sore loser, buddy. This is stupid, pal. I'm ah. way too strong. a pill bottle. Try again. Hey there. Answer his own question. I've met my match. Looks like a good time. Come on, do it. Hit me. Don't be a <laughs> Wow. Holy fuck. You know, I don't like the hammer. I feel like the hammer, I'm kind of getting fucked because it's so slow. All right, let's not go hammer. No hammer this time. Hey there, pal. Yeah, we. I think we almost had him and on, uh, I it. fucked me. up. Don't be a No 
one likes a sore loser, buddy! Uh, let's swap. Uh, actually, no, let's do that. You're gonna regret standing in my way. Fuck you, man. Anyone ever told you how punchable your face is? Stop shooting me! What? Dude, this guy is kicking my ass right now. <laughs> I'm getting my ass whooped by this fucking guy. <laughs> I am getting my ass whooped by this. Jeez, man. Oh, no, I don't have my, uh, I don't have my, uh, thing here. Fuck. Hey there, pal. Yeah, you can make the game easier. Yeah, you can make Come it. Come on, do it. Hit me. I mentioned blurry concentration mode. Uh, oh, I'm not blurry. Okay. I thought I fixed my blur. Does it did. I think I have to go back to the title screen. <laughs> yeah, I think I gotta go back. Oh, fuck. Wait, do I have to go do all this stuff now? He sent me all the way back to the title screen. Oh, yeah, that's right. There was a die. That's right. I actually forgot that there was a die instantly option, right? Completely forgot about that. This is fantastic. Thanks for all the content. Uh, hey, Jay Meelan, thank you for 32 months. I greatly appreciate that. Thank you, Jay Meelan. Okay, let's try this again. Hey there. Platforming God, Come thank on, you. Come on, do it! Hit me! Don't be a coward! Sorry. <laughs> Dude. Bro, he killed me, so like if he parries you in his shell, it does damage to you, like a lot of damage to you, apparently. Okay, so let's uh Let's uh, not do that. 
Uh, I guess let's go back to the N64 hammer here. Let's try that. Hey there, pal. Yeah, I gotta stop attacking. It does a lot of damage, yeah. Come on, do it! Hit me! Don't be a cow! Dude, I am getting fucked up. No one likes a sore loser, buddy! What you think, pal? He is fucking me up. He is really fucking me up, man. <laughs> uh, thank you, Jay Mullen. Appreciate that. Uh, okay, okay. We're learning. Feels like if you can just parry him, uh, I think we'd be okay. Come on, do it! Hit me! Don't be a coward! I did not mean to swing there. In my way. Okay, we're getting the parries are getting better. Stop shooting me, piece of shit. Oh. I hate his smug face. A better boss than Elden Dinosaur. <laughs> All right. We've been to this phase once before. Let's see if we have it this time.
I take care of you, my life's gonna roll! <laughs> Put that on. So I put this on. I think I get what Kite meant now. Krill, hold on. Let's talk about this like adults. If I'm gonna be angry, I might as well use it for something good. So that maybe one day other people won't have to fight like me. And what better way to start than to beat up a selfish. Greedy muscle shocker like yeah! wait, 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 wait. <laughs> The fuck am I playing right now? <laughs> Is it over? What happened to the whorl? I think I messed up again. My word, have you seen some? I've never seen so much trash before. It's a miracle, I tell you. Someone up there really does care about us. Aha, Krill, my friend. So deeply pleased to see you survive. You can see we're having quite the exciting time. First, we escaped the bowels of hell itself. Now, Trash Island itself collapsed onto our fair city. On the other hand, such property damage, our poor architecture. Surely folks come from miles around to see the carnage. I get to greet so many fa uh, fresh faces. Every massive cloud of trash is a silver lining. Hey, hey, pal. No hard feelings, sir. I hope Kitan's okay. I did what she said, I got angry, and I stopped first. I guess things might have even been worse down here if I hadn't, but I sure don't feel like I helped. Unbelievable, the whole city's been totally covered in trash. Really couldn't save anyone, could I? The city's totally ruined. Are you kidding? This is the best day of my life. We're all gonna be rich, I tell you. Grab all the trash your claws can carry. Holy Krill, is that really you? It's me. Thank you for your expression, you've got something to do with this whole mess. Told you nothing good could come of messing about in the trench with that old timer. Where is that flim flimer anyway? I oughta... He's dead. Oh. Oh, Han. A whole bunch of people died, and I don't know if Kitan's okay. I thought maybe the, the shell could make things better. But I think Firth and I broke it in our fight. Seems like none of this happened. None of this had to happen at all. I want to be mad, but there's no one left to be mad at. I see, it looks super messed up now, too. I'm sorry, Nemma. Or for what it's worth, most everyone here seems to be excited by this whole mess. They haven't seen so much trash in their whole lives, after all. But if it's true what they said about the gunk, it's only a matter of time before all this comes back to bite us. So yeah, it ain't looking great, kiddo. Trash up above, fell down below. Everyone's super excited, but Mom's real worried for some reason. I guess it's pretty stinky. You and your kids are still gonna stay in the city? Of course we are, kiddo. We ain't done with this town just yet. Even now that it's all messed up? Look, leaving ain't all that easy, Krill. Besides, ain't no one else gonna cook a heart kelp gnocchi this time, this fine for the people down here. Stuff keeps on getting worse. Well, if I can help make it a little less bad along the way, that's a life worth living as far as I'm concerned. What about your kids? We're gonna learn to fight like mom. Yeah, violence rules. Like shell you are, young ladies. Ahem, we'll be all right, Krill. We're just about, we're just about old enough to make their own choices and not have to worry about what, what their mama tells them. Better question is, what are you gonna do? I'm gonna do what I set out to do. I earned it, didn't I? I suppose you did, kiddo. It was just a disaster. I was minding my own business, listening to my show tunes, and my whole apartment collapsed and slid down into the lower crust. I can't live down there. What am I meant to do for fun? Rate, rate the stinkiest stinks? Yeah, right. What ho? We're in for quite the economic upheaval, it seems. But shall this influx of trash be the city's rate equalizer, or will the rich exploit this opportunity to get even richer? For my sake, I hope it's the latter. Huzzah! Because you've been hell and back. 
Stop it off. You're shellless, just like me. Yep, sure am. On my advice, kid, learn to appreciate the times you got a shell on and commit those times to memory. Keep you warm when you're without one. So prime, prime cell. Crabs up top don't understand is that even the finest shells last forever. No matter how bad we want them to. God damn right. Time to come. When those suckers above, up above find themselves out, they'll flounder and cry. But you and I will be we'll be around the reef, ain't we? We're going to preserve. Eh, eh, eh. Uh, Red Jam, thank you for 17 months. Bime Taz cart, Dingo. Bime cart, bime cart. Thank you for 18 months. What am I going to do next? I guess I always wanted to go back to the tide pool and do nothing. Is that what I want? This adventure was a huge waste of time, and it was hard and painful. So why did I keep on doing it? There must have been something I liked about it, right? Maybe Nemma's right. Maybe I should just stay in the city with her. But I don't like it here either. I know that's not what I want. Nemma's real nice, but this isn't my home. Maybe I haven't found my home yet. Look pretty down on your luck, little man. You could say that. Maybe you have one of those days where you just want to try and try, but absolutely nothing at all goes your way. The more upset about it you get, the worse everything seems to go. Yeah. You know what always perks me up? Eating trash. My mom always said your mood can't go south and there's plastic in your mouth. Hope that helps. <laughs> <laughs> Great, just when I needed more noise and excitement. I'm sorry, this is all a big accident. Oh, this is your fault? Thanks a lot, mate. First, Roland goes missing out at sea at some whack job treasure hunt. And now a new Carcinia floods of trash. Scuttleport is so screwed, it's not even funny. What am I going to do for work now? All us to shells of the upper crusters? So I guess things could be worse. Could have been staffed on that crazy barge. You got lost sea like the rest of them. Uh, that guy gives you a skill. Which guy? The urchin guy? Oh, I never thought I'd see you again, kid. You seen all this? It sounds never been so trash rich. It's a totally new era. Yeah, you're welcome. How about giving me my shell back as thanks? Are you kidding me? I don't got to give you anything, pal. Trash influx is going to be great for business. I'm a rich prawn now. I'm operating on a different level. If you ain't got something I really need, get out of my face. Attack. What word comes to mind when you think of the Earth? This world is resilient, but not endlessly so. As this Earth spins ever faster towards its uncertain future, all will face that future in their own way. Some will fight for the world they dream of, blade in hand. Some will spend their whole lives saving others from falling through the cracks. And others still will never rest in one place for long. As this fragile world begins to fracture, no matter how large or small, the one thing no creature can afford is complacency. But though history talks of warriors and heroes, and great mighty crabs that shook the world. It is the thankless deeds that shall ever make that world worth fighting for. Aw, uh, did we give away our shell to the one guy who didn't have his own shell? When we first met, I'd hoped you might clean Finn. up the <laughs> Oh man. Um, well, uh, you know, I came into this game. GG. Uh, I came into this game kind of being like, what is this garbage? I kind of want to play this shit. This is, this is going to look terrible. Uh, I was wrong. This game was super charming, very fun. Had a great time with this game. Definite recommend. Uh, just a really, really fun game. Really, really fun all around. Uh, Fun mechanics, fun exploration, fun bosses. Just a great time. Really great time. Go get the Praise the Sun costume. Yeah, awesome game. Liberal propaganda. It's liberal propaganda. We, you can dump your trash in the ocean. Nothing wrong with that. <laughs> I don't know what ever happened with the loan shark. I don't know what ever happened with him. Yeah, we never found the loan shark ever. Yeah, really fun game. Really fun. I had a great time with this one. They love trash. Uh, Kirby Squishy. 
Thank you for the tier three 37 months. Trash sacks good for the ocean. Dump all your plastic on in. Uh, Kirby Squishy, thank you for the tier three 37 months. Thank you very much. Appreciate that. Yeah, I don't know whatever happened with the loan shark. Cheering for the pawn shop, right? <laughs> I hope he gets another one. People get Lone Shark and the DLC. Yeah, awesome time. Really enjoyed this game. Definitely recommend. Um, you know, obviously it's a bit easier in terms of a Souls-like. It's a bit of an easier game. Um, there's also ways you can lower the difficulty too. Yeah, just uh, really had a good time. I have to get back to work and I'm probably in trouble, but worth. <laughs> Are there multiple endings? I don't know. I don't know. What? Hang on. Better final boss than Elden Beast. Yeah, as always, it's true. <laughs> you think the loan shark was the prawn? Uh, maybe, right? But then why even pretend? Why even the song and dance about the shark was the one that sold him the, the shell, right? Why? I don't know the point of that. What if you attack the whirl rather than wear it? This, I don't know if that does something. I have no idea. Chat says it was because Krill is an idiot. What I rate this game out of 10? Uh, I think I'd give this game a solid, uh, I'm gonna say seven out of 10, seven out of 10. Um, I think that, uh, you know, fun combat, fun exploration, fun world. I'd say like minus a few points cause the beginning's a little slow. It takes a little while for the game to kind of warm up. Um, I'd say uh, the combat sometimes felt like a little a little strange, a little janky once in a while. Um, some of the bosses really were like a little watching this playthrough. Like okay, but Jack got you to play overall, it. really enjoyed it. Overall, enjoyed it. Very fun. Uh, no crabs where I'm. Thanks for playing. Any post credit scenes? Oh, that's it. All right, GG. Yeah, I had a really good time. Yeah, that's a 10 out of 10 by IGN standards. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what IGN will get this game. I'd say a 7, maybe. I'd say 7 out of 10 seems pretty good. I enjoyed the game, though. Enjoyed it.